coming back with another updated video. Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy Zigzag. Before this video actually gets started, uh, please bear with me. This was my first riding and talking on the GoPro video. Uh, I didn't realize that you could actually hear me because uh, I didn't know the noise reduction was really that good on it. So there will be parts of the video where I won't be talking. And that's because I'm thinking you can't hear me. But on the parts where I am talking, I'm at a low speed and it's uh, the wind was not really high. So my upcoming videos, you will be able to hear me. I will do a lot more talking. But this will be episode one of Zigzag Rides. I hope you enjoy don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. And also uh, leave your comments at the bottom. And let's go ahead and get this video started. What is up, YouTube? It's your boy Zigzag. Coming back with another updated video. All right. Finally, I have said that I have gotten myself a GoPro. I am actually very excited because this is my first real riding vlog uh with the gopro on the harley now guys please excuse the harley right now it's pretty dirty uh i'm going to clean it up today but i have an event i have to be at at a certain time and i also uh don't have a lot of time to do this vlog at the same time i'm excited about doing this vlog so we're going to try to just just make it work right now but uh this vlog today is basically uh what i call uh being uh trying to be safe on your harleys man on, on not just the harleys but but uh your motorcycles in general um one thing that i do like about the harley uh it does have the abs braking system um it's it's very comfortable you know to ride you know it's a it's a big vehicle pretty pretty heavy uh mobile machine here but at the same time if you're coming from uh crotch rocket into a harley it's going to be a big difference which is what happened with me i was riding a uh, uh kawasaki zx6r and uh it was a very light motorcycle, um, 400 and some pounds, I believe it was. And that was the only thing I rode and until I actually got into the uh, cruisers or touring bikes. I actually just skipped the regular cruiser and went straight to the touring bike. And uh, I'm going to tell you, it was a big difference coming from uh, a crotch rocket to a touring bike. But I don't regret not one day of doing so because, I mean... Uh, it's a lot more comfortable. Um, the the handling to me is a lot was a lot better, you know. And uh, I can control this bike this bike here uh, actually better than I did the uh, crotch rocket. I guess because you're you're going to be more alert, and more aware of your surroundings. You know, your biggest thing when you're switching from a crotch rocket to uh, a heavy duty haul per se you know 850 some pound bike uh one of the things you're definitely going to watch for is uh being able not <laughs> being careful not to drop it basically because a lot of guys you know they say hey i've been riding for years i've been riding since i was 12 years old and don't have not one license okay and if you don't <laughs> you know that lets me know that you know you just been country boy riding is what i call it you know you've been riding in the country you've been riding up and down those roads but you're scared to get on the interstate you know you're scared to pass big trucks and all that kind of stuff so you know this this like i say this is about a little safety and and owning a harley um so i'm gonna ride you know and and, and try to see if i can talk and, and vlog at the same time and we're going to try to give you a good experience. You know, one of the first things, like I say, when you hop on this Harley, I mean, you feel totally different than you would on that crotch rocket. Um, it's, it's comfortable. It's, you're sitting back and not up. 
you're sitting behind the tank instead of sitting um, on the tank. So, you know, let's go ahead and crank her up and, and get this video going. Let's see here, no music today. It's just going to be me talking. And hopefully y'all can hear me. I don't know how good this... Uh, this noise reduction thing is on this uh, GoPro, but hopefully you'll be able to hear me. Wait a minute, let's get started. And when you first get on your Harley, uh, my, my advice to you is to get to know the bike first. Uh, try to get yourself acclimated and comfortable with the feel of the bike, because I'm gonna tell you, you will drop this bike, especially uh, this big road glide or street glide, you will drop it if you're not used to anything this heavy. But the more you ride it, the more it feels lighter to you. The more control you have over it. And you know, uh, Find you some guys that like to ride. Um, if you don't want to ride alone, I don't mind riding alone myself, but if you don't have anybody to ride with, just hop on it, ride it to work. Get yourself used to it. Ride it to the convenience store. Ride it to the grocery store. Ride it to your child's uh, sporting event. You know, anything that you can do just to uh, get yourself used to this bike. Big difference. We're just gonna take some of these roads, country roads. else not just yourself here today. I think the temperature today right now is about 70 degrees. Man, you cannot beat it.
Alright, hopefully y'all can hear me right now. <clears throat> but like I said, you know, ride your Harley much as possible because the more you ride it, the more you'll get used to it. <laughs> Don't be that guy that says, hey, look, I know how to ride, I know how to ride, and then, you know, you're riding down the highway and you see a guy trying to pick an 850 50 something pound motorcycle up off the highway. right so especially through towns you know riding uh, through the cities and everything you know get yourself used to riding with traffic and and uh, stop lights this is not uh, a big area for lights this is just a little country part of South Georgia here. I kind of like riding up through here because it's got some really, really good roads. <clears throat> Matter of fact, when I first bought this Harley, these were the little back roads that I, I actually practiced with. Oh yeah, also I, I took the, uh, the Harley Davidson training courses. Uh, that's how I got my license and I'm gonna tell you I don't care how long you've been riding you can take those courses and you'll learn things that you thought you knew that you really didn't know how to how to get out of certain situations that you thought you knew how to get out of I've had some <clears throat> really close encounters that uh, could have went bad but you know because I took that Harley training course uh, I knew what to do. I've had I, I had guys in that um, training course that said they had been riding Harleys for 20 years, and they fell off that uh, training bike probably five or six times throughout the course of the uh, throughout the uh, course of the uh, e event there. You know, trying to learn and trying to ride. They didn't, they, you know, don't, don't be fooled because you don't want to be a statistic, that's for sure. Get yourself some training. I think that was the best, uh, I think I paid $199 for that course. So my suggestion is to uh, take that course. <laughs> Having some over there at the nursing home. I ought to go over there and give a donation. I think I'll do that later. up here we're gonna turn off up here this road right here that I'm about to turn on um, it's a it's the first road I actually did a hundred uh, when I had the uh, crotch rocket I did like my first time riding it I did uh, like a hundred and twenty miles an hour or something like that and man that just blew my mind of course I don't ride like that now And I love the sound of those pipes. Ride hearts, baby.
characters. That was a nice stretch right there. I think we ought to stop and go get something to eat. How about that? I think I'm entitled. <laughs> I think I'm entitled to these videos, zigzag rides. Because that's basically all it's gonna be, videos of me riding. <laughs> the rider
we are coming into the city. Chick-fil-A over there. Mm. Yeah, I should I should entitle these videos zigzag ride. Because I'm probably gonna just be riding and trying to talk. Uh, nothing in particular, I reckon. I'm just a country boy out here riding my Harley. <laughs> You guys put your suggestions on there. I don't know if some of you may be like me. I just like to get on YouTube and just watch people ride their uh, Harleys. <laughs> Tell you what, this thing rides a lot quieter since I put that Mobile One V-Twin 2050 weight in here. All right, people, come on. out a little bit in the city. Gotta love that Harley clump. Let's pull in over here. 